So I took a little hiatus. An unannounced hiatus. Uh, so a couple things have, you know, gone or come to pass within the last month or however long it's been since I've made a, another video. I turned 24, my boyfriend turned 25, I got this haircut, and I received a 23andMe genotyping kit in the mail. For those of you who didn't know, April 24th was DNA Day. Because of DNA Day, 23andMe put their $500 genotyping kit on sale for $100. So, this was kind of a birthday present to myself. Um, what this is, is, like I said, a genotyping kit. And what I have to do is spit in a tube up to that line there, so that much spit. This is going to be disgusting. That much spit, and then I put it in here, and then I mail it. And then I get information back about um, my ancestral line, my um, especially my maternal line, my um, genetic predisposition to diseases. Um, what else? Oh no! I think I just spilled alcohol on myself. How did that happen? Yeah, I didn't even know that there was, there's liquid in here, in case, and if you do this in the future, there's alcohol in there. I didn't know that. Ah, damn it. Um, anyway, go to the website. It's, it's 23andme.com. And, damn it. And, uh, you can get your own kit, and hopefully they'll be doing this again next year. This, um, this DNA Day thing, because I really think that uh, stuff like this is pretty badass. You know, finding stuff out about your uh, potential <clears throat> uh, genetic predisposition to diseases and all that kind of stuff. I don't know, some people think it's scary. I'm not so scared by it. Okay. So we're gonna do this together. Um, I got this liquid all over. I don't even know what it is. Um, okay, so the I have the instructions here. Um, most people take between two and five minutes to deliver a saliva sample, following steps one through five. <laughs> before, <laughs> before spitting, relax and rub your cheeks gently for 30 seconds to create saliva. If you find it hard to create saliva, place one teaspoon of white table sugar on your tongue. Uh, step number one, spit until the amount of, sali of liquid saliva, not bubbles, reaches the fill line shown in picture number one. Hold the tube upright with one hand, close the lid with the other as shown by firmly pushing the lid until you hear a loud click. The liquid in the lid will be released into the tube. Oh, that's what you are to mix with the saliva, make sure that the lid is cl closed tightly, hold the tube upright, unscrew the tube, blah blah blah, put a cap on. Okay. So I'm gonna spit in this tube. Uh, that's what this video is gonna be. I'm gonna go ahead and spit in this tube. <laughs> My mouth is always dry. <laughs> Ah, uh, the things I do for YouTube. <laughs> oh, that's gross. I don't like spit. Um, so while I'm doing this, I'll, um, I'm gonna do a, uh, another blog TV tomorrow. Well, another one. I haven't done one in a really long time, but <laughs> but uh, I wanted to do one tomorrow, maybe at like I don't know one o'clock. 
Yeah, one o'clock sounds about right. Um, so yeah, blog TV. I'll put the link in the. It's not a sidebar anymore. It's a bottom bar. This is probably the grossest video I've ever made. Second only to the kissing video, I'm sure. So anyway, once I hit this fill line, which I haven't yet, um, I'm going to shake this up, I'm going to send it away, and then I'll make another video when I get my results back, because I'm sure you guys are just as curious as I am. Um, I'll make more videos before that. I just needed a break from YouTube, guys.